How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla today. As always, we're going to be doing a new challenge today that I've never done before. I'm calling it the Copycat Legend Challenge. It's basically where whatever legend my opponent is using, I have to copy and use that legend the next game. So for the very first game, I'm just going to go random. And uh, whatever legend my opponent is using, that's what legend I'm going to use next game. Hopefully I don't get the same legend over and over and over. Because some people like to pick the same legend over and over and over. I think that's kind of boring. It's good when you're training with that one legend, but you should really play all legends, guys. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and start with Thatch. By the way, um, many people have suggested this kind of video in the past, so um, I'm not giving credit to one single person, but just know that I do read your comments. I, I, I don't always do everything that you guys want me to do, but... This is one that has been requested multiple times in the past, and I always thought it was a good idea and it just never got around to doing it, but we're doing it today, baby. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day, wherever you guys might be. I definitely am. And finally, we got a match. Alright, so it looks like my next game, I'm playing Hattori. This is good that I'm playing Thatch, because I've had some uh, people request that I play Thatch as well. You would think I would be good with Thatch because he has sword and I'm pretty good with sword, uh, but surprisingly I'm usually losing when I play Thatch. Oh man, Hattori accidentally killed herself. That's really unfortunate. You know, uh, one of the things that I always say, like if you're trying to get to uh, silver or gold, you can't kill yourself. You gotta take that out of the equation. You'll get a lot more wins. Playing very uh, defensively, and it's kind of getting him killed quite a bit. He's also killing himself, which doesn't help, but... I might get a three stock here. Nothing to brag about, just saying. For my first match of the video, not bad. GG dude, GG. Alright, so you guys know what happens next. I'm going Hattori, baby! Oh man, I don't have to copy the skin though, just the legend. Hmm, which skin should I use? I haven't used Katsune Hattori in quite a while. Guess we can go ahead and use this. I'll go uh, base stance. I didn't actually look at the stance my opponent was using, but we'll go ahead and throw that in. Whatever stance they're using, I'll copy as well. Which I may re end up regretting that, but we'll see. Alright, we're going against Scarlet, so that means I get to use Scarlet next match. Alright, not bad. This is actually a bad matchup for Hattori. Scarlet has so much power, and Hattori doesn't have a lot of defense. So, we'll see how this goes. Wish me luck, homies. The best way to play Hattori is to play aggressively. I'll say that. Oh my. Oh, caught her with that speed. Chase dodge in or whatever. Gonna make her go right into that. Oh. Wow, that Sig has a generous hitbox, as we all kind of vouch for. Okay, that one too. My goodness, Scarlet Hammer hits literally everything in its wake. 
which I'm looking forward to using next game. Oops. Don't know why I did the neutral sig there. There we go. I was hoping she would jump above, and she did. Never go above Hattori's sword, man. Oh, that defense! Oh, I dodged the lance! Oh, but I don't have the uh, jump. Alright guys, final socks, Ray J, weapon starving, as he should. game. Yep. GG, dude. G, I I was trying to do the salute, but whatever. Alright, guys, so I get to play Scarlet next game! Ooh, let's see. Oh, man. I like playing Scarlet. She's kind of a bully. Let's. I'm gonna go with the same one he had. I didn't actually pay attention to what stance he was using. My bad. My bad. We're just gonna go base stance. Oh, and I get to be Cesariel. Oh, this is actually pretty fun. Copycat challenge. I suggest everybody give it a try. It makes the game more interesting. You get to play lots of different legends, hopefully. Maybe even some legends you're not comfortable with, which is good. Yeah. I hate getting hit by that hammer side sig as well, but dude, so don't hate don't hate the player, hate the game, you know what I mean? Oh, again with that side sig, dude. So brutal. It hits so much space. Oh, nice side sig. He almost got me at that. Oh, man. Ooh. Ooh, he missed. That's another three stock, boys. Look how happy Scarlet is. Oh, man. GG, dude. GG. Three stock on the diamond. Blur. And now we're going to use Blur's legend, Zario. Let's go. Where is he? There he is. Oh, man. I'm going to do uh, Secret Admirer Scar Zario. You don't see this one too often, boys. This one you can only get during the uh, Valentine's Day event, so around February. Hey, it's Chirpius. He's actually really good, so this is going to be a tough match. Three, two, one, brawl. Zariel versus Artemis. Let's go, baby. Oh, I didn't touch the wall. Are you kidding me, BMG? 
How is that not a touch? Chirpy! Got it, baby. Even though I pretty much gave him my first stock, we're gonna take this game back. Well, at least we're gonna try to. Wow, I had no j no recovery or dodge after that hit. Oh man. Oh, all right. Wow, he actually zeroed himself to make this a more interesting game. be real I would not have won if he didn't have the honor kill so GG dude GG Chirpy is so cool and now I get to be Artemis in the next match such a nice guy dude such a nice guy and you guys know what that means I'm going Artemis where is Artemis wait where there she is yes Artemis is a female according to the lore all right let's go ahead and use hmm Let's use Future Spirit Artemis. This one looks so cool. Should I just do default colors? Honestly, Skyforge, they all look really good. I'll, I'll go side Skyforge though. All right, here we go. We're going against another Artemis Lycan. Mirror match. This will probably be my uh, last fight because I'm not gonna be Artemis twice. Dude is insane! Oh, nice read on my dodge up. I'm like so tired right now, my brain is fuzzy. That's how you do the down sink, bro. Boom. 
Oh, that turnaround off the platform. Ooh, now he's whipping out the side six. Don't be predictable, and you'll win most of your matches. I guess I was too predictable there. He side-aired me. Oh, well. Let's go, Chirpy! Oh, wait, no, I'm not fighting Chirpy anymore. G. Player two wins. All right, I'll do one more game as random, just because random. I feel like we have enough time to do that. All right, glow box, I'll work with that. I just didn't want to be Artemis again. All right, we're going against the Olgrim. Yarmageddon. Here we go, boys. Three, two, one, brawl. I'm like struggling to hit this uh Trying to do that after I do a uh, neutral light. The uh, I don't even remember what that's called, but Ooh. oops! I really thought I would get the hit and then have a chase dodge, but he dodged me like a ninja. down on a hammer when you got unarmed? Oh man. Alright, well, GG Olgrim. It was fun. Fighting while 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 you are still fighting, GG dude, GG. All right, guys. Well, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the copycat strikeout. Please go ahead and drop a like if you did. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. As always, guys. This is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.